Jonathan Kirksey, and I play the cello. I started playing cello when I was six, and I'm 34 now, so 28 years. Long time. Classical music, it's my main thing. I've been playing with the symphony for about 11 years now. Orchestra jobs are really tough to get. They're very competitive, and there's a pretty rigorous audition process that you have to go through. You're sitting on a stage all by yourself, and you play these short excerpts that you've prepared ahead of time. They're expected to be flawless. You know, when I was younger, I grew up playing cello and then guitar. So I was always playing both classical music and rock and roll, although they were, they were kind of separate. And it wasn't really until after college that they sort of converged or I started playing cello in, with some bands. And the first band that I really did that with was The Lost Sounds, actually, with Alicia Trout and, and Jay Retard. With that band especially, it was really, really difficult to just be heard at all, to try to be heard over those deafeningly loud guitars and drums. It was really tough. It took me a few years to, to figure out how to do that, how to get myself loud enough with the cello to be able to, to compete with electric guitars. It took a lot of tweaking and a lot of gear. different bands right now, a band called Mouse Rocket, and Rob Junkless, sometimes with Harlan T. Bobo, Fingers Like Saturn, I've played with Snow Globe, The Lost Sounds, uh, played with Al Green, and played on a couple of his records. That was, that was really a lot of fun. Playing in the symphony, even though it is a really large group, you have to pay a lot more attention to detail. Tiny little mistakes can make a, a huge difference. You have to play exactly what's written on the page. You can't deviate from that. And it's kind of like, it's this big machine that's, that's going along and you have to go along with it. You can't fight it. And it's very powerful. You're sitting on stage with 60 people playing at the same time. Playing in a band is a lot different because you have a lot more creative freedom to play whatever you want. So, so most of the time I'm, I'm just improvising my parts or I write them myself. And so having that creative freedom is really nice. It's not so much playing the cello that I really love it's playing music in general, whatever instrument that may be, if it's guitar or drums or cello or whatever. I love making music and uh, making music with other people. <laughs> 